obviously know we are not going to have a calculator for this test. We obviously know we do not have no idea how to take the cosine of 31 degrees or the cosine of 1 degrees, right? And we can't even break apart these angles to be able to do that. However, we do recognize this formula because it's written on the board and it's also written on our formula sheet. And we recognize this formula is the representation of what? Cosine of the sum or the difference of two angles. It's the difference of two angles. This is basically the same thing as cosine of 31 degrees minus 1 degree. Now, since this is inside of the function, can I combine these? Yes. So I'm really, this, I'm just asking you, what is the cosine of 30 degrees? Why not? Uh, yes, we did. Inside of the function, can you apply the operations? That's what I did. Look at, no, 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 no. Look. Square root of 9 minus 4, what do you do? You have to subtract. That's what we're doing. Either way, so we have cosine of 30 degrees. We can look at your answer, what you're going So the cosine of 30 degrees is 30 degrees, carry the 1, right there. Oh, you think you get it, huh? <laughs>